BMW E30 and quite a few other BMWs because today we're visiting a motorsports cafe here in Bangkok that you definitely need to put on your bucket list if you're visiting Thailand and you are a car guy. Look at how close these motorbikes get to your car. It's terrifying. Somebody recently asked me if I was gonna blend my Pandem wide body kit into the car, and that's the reason I would never do that. Because if one of these motorbikes do hit you, which they will hit your shit and not care at all, and then run off, well then, I just have to replace a Pandem fender instead of doing a massive amount of body work. So that is the reason why I will never blend the wide body kit into cream pie, because eventually, one of these motorbikes will hit my car and it's gonna suck, but it'll suck a lot less if I can just unbolt a fender flare and bolt a new one on. First stop is a local detailing center to get cream pie washed because that cream pie was absolutely disgusting. See, I attempted to shoot this video yesterday. I rocked up in front of a 7-Eleven right in front of my new condo and typical Bangkok weather this time of year, it was a total monsoon within minutes. By the way, I've officially moved back to Bangkok, which is awesome. I still have my beach condo, but Bangkok is where my heart is. I love this city. So now they're taking it from the wash bay over here to finish the detailing. But look at this, holy crap. That is a brand new Ferrari F8 with a red plate. If you don't know, when you see a car in Thailand that if it has a red plate, it means it's a brand new car. And this F8, with the 300% import duty tax here in Thailand, this car is well over a million US dollars. I know, it's just total insanity. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> There's five people cleaning my car. It's hilarious. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, how much is it? Uh, 300, 300 baht. 300 baht. 300 baht. Yeah. Thank you, cup and cup. Cup. Harness up. Safety first in Thailand. Or fifth, or whatever. Okay, 300 baht, aka 8 US dollars later, and cream pie is spick and span. And we are headed to our destination for today. I already forgot what the place was called, but I do know, oi, this is a tough place to pull out, but I do know it is epic. Okay, let's do this thing. say this it's so freaking awesome to be back in Bangkok like officially I got a another condo here in Bangkok I still have my beach condo but Bangkok is just where I belong I freaking love this city I feel like Casey Neistat moving back to New York Bangkok is like what gives me my energy it gives me my vibe it's so motivating I love this city but I hate driving in it <laughs> driving in Bangkok freaking sucks. It is not a place you want to drive a lowered, loud race car. Um, yeah, don't do it. This is not fun. <laughs> yeah, the traffic here sucks.
or this truck I'm going for. Oh, don't get hit by the Raptor. Okay, our location's supposed to be right up here. Where is it? Why did they want me to park like this? Nice. I got VIP parking. Thank you, cup and cup. Okay guys, we've officially made it to Super Cafe. Get it? Cafe, it's a cafe with cars. But before we head in there, I wanna remind you to go grab your brand new cream pie t-shirts only available at CB Media on youtube.com. It's a great way to support the channel and show your love for cream pie, my BMW E30, all around the world. Okay, let's go in here and check out this Carfe thing. So the first thing you notice is like this retro racing cart, and then they have a bunch of really cool racing wheels over here. But let's go check out Carfe, see what this place is about. <laughs> Uh, I don't know which way to turn. Oh my God, look at this. This is the BMW M1 race car. This is insane to see this here. Oh my, look, and it's center seat racing car. Holy shit, this thing is sick. Wow. I don't think I've ever actually even seen one of these cars in person. Talking about a rare BMW. This is an extremely, extremely rare vehicle. And damn, it looks sick. Sweaty crop, can I have uh, Thai milk tea? Oh, right, sir. Ice Thai milk tea, right? Chai cup. Oh, right, 49, 49 baht? Yeah. That's it? Wow, it's cheap. Thank you, cup and cup. Dude, 49 baht for Thai milk tea? It's crazy cheap. They are definitely hardcore BMW guys. Like, look at all this. Thailand Grand Touring Championship car, 1999 to 2001. BMW E36 M3 GT. Look at all of these like race cars. Pictures of race cars they have up here. This E36 looks like a blast. I would love to have a couple laps around the track. But what the hell is up with this thing? Do you see how much not just tire it is tucking, it is actually tucking wheel. Holy crap, that thing is low. There's no way that thing is driven, even on a racetrack with that type of stance. But it does look freaking sick. What the hell is going on back there? That's like some crazy E46 race car. Holy shit, do you guys see that? Um, I didn't know that was there. I thought this was just a cafe. We're gonna see if we can get back there, I promise. Okay, first, let me enjoy my 49 baht Thai milk tea. All the photos over here are like retro classic. Look, Street Circuit, Bang Sand Beach, Chambury, 2007 to 2012. These are all, and look at all the trophies. Look at all the trophies. All of this is like retro motorsports. Oh, look, there's even more trophies over here. This is all like retro motorsports memorabilia from here in Thailand, from way back in the day. Thailand Grand Touring Car, 1999. Wow. Wait, Championship of Thailand, 1987 Touring Car Group A, 1600 CC. Dude, this stuff is freaking cool. By the way, I really love the way that their tables are set up with this racing slick and this deep dish wheel. And they even have like a, a printed brake rotor and caliper in there. <laughs> it's all the tables are like this. Look, this one's green though. Uh, this one is black. And this one is gold. You have a Pajero Evolution. Yeah. Not a Lancer Evolution. Yeah. When you come to these type of uh, places, you always end up meeting so many cool people. 
This is what I love about traveling as a car guy. This guy's got a Pajero Evolution? What? How many of those have you ever seen? I've seen like two my entire life. He's gonna show us photos of it. Oh man, that thing is badass, dude. Oh yeah, I see your Z. Yeah. Man, oh. Man. Here's the thing. Car guys all around the world are always car guys. Thank you, of course. Thank you. You're welcome. M M T E E92. E92 M3. And uh six speed. Thank you. My name is Ian. Nice to meet you, bro. I'm Chad. Yeah. Nice to meet you. I showed him photos of my car. And he was like, dude, I gotta check this thing out. That's one thing. Car guys are car guys, no matter where you are in the world. Okay, let's see if we can go in the garage and check out what's going on with this E46 race car. Wow. Look at the engine, door. I didn't ask if I could come in here or not. I hope this is okay. This thing is insane. Holy shit. I did not expect to see this here. I did not know this was going to be here. I just expected to see the M1 and the E46. That thing is total insanity and a very pleasant addition to today's Car Guy vlog here in Bangkok. If you enjoyed it, make sure that you're subscribed and don't forget to go grab your cream pie apparel only available at CB Media on youtube.com and I'll see you in another video very soon. Peace.